Hi friends, it's Auntie Cuckoo and today I'm sharing a Dollar Tree haul with you guys. I've got quite a few items to share. I've popped in a few times, so this is a collective haul. Let's start out with something that I'm just super surprised to find at the Dollar Tree. This is an 11.9 ounce of the Butterfinger Mini candy bars. Now, I don't love Butterfinger, but the kids like them and these are the perfect little addition to Easter eggs. You get about 18 bars per bag. It's a really good size, especially for the Dollar Tree. I think that's a really good deal. So I did pick up two of those, set those aside. Now what I went in for were some household needs. So these little wipes I keep in my car because they're the perfect size for a cup holder and we're always on the go with kids so i just like to keep these in my van so i can do a quick cleanup if i need to and they're perfect because they just fit right in the cup holder i was also out of my mouthwash that i buy at the dollar tree this one's my favorite it's sort of the knockoff of listerine and then i needed more of one of my favorite items from the dollar tree the placards. Now be careful when you're shopping for these little flossers because they have a few different brands and some of them have about 30 in them. This one as you can see has 60 so I always keep an eye out for that. And I needed some dryer sheets so I picked up. These Breezy actually smell really good. You get about 55 per pack and sometimes um, they can be really strong, so be sure to not package them with any food items. I have made that mistake before. Another household need that I was almost out of is the Laundry Booster. This one is by Totally Awesome. It's called Oxygen Orange, and I use this to clean all kinds of things in my house. I love this stuff. Now, this wasn't a need, but I always try and pick them up when I find them. These are actually on the medicine aisle, sort of with the bandages, and they do have little vitamins and stuff. These are great little gloves for DIYs. So if you're gonna be staining something or painting and you don't wanna get it all over your hands, pick these up because they do really well and you get 10 gloves per pack. Now, <laughs> I have craft items, I have some toys. Let's go over here. So something kind of on the same aisle, Health and Beauty, is the LA Colors. This is a contour and highlight. So you can see right here is the darker one and this is the lighter. As I'm getting older, I am realizing that lining my lips doesn't work like it used to. So I actually like to take something like this that is sort of a natural skin color and go under my lips and it just helps a little bit with those lines that are happening so that's why I picked this up I probably won't use the contour side but I've been looking for one I know wet and wild used to sell one and I just couldn't find one so I was happy to run into that some more great finds on the health and beauty aisle are their bolero wipes now you can't always find them, but when you do, I suggest picking them up. We got a couple in the watermelon mint and a couple in the pineapple, coconut lime. We use Bolero wipes whenever possible. They're very gentle, we have sensitive skin, and so we were happy to find them in the stores. Now, you can't always find them, so we always pick these up, hoping that this will be a returning item. These are actually makeup removing wipes, which is what we use the Bolero wipes for in our house. These are by Pro Selection, and so we thought, let's give these a try in case we can't find Bolero next time. My daughter also wanted to pick up some of their bath bombs, so we got one of the little three packs. And then, same area, they have some amazing toothbrushes right now for kids. So they did have this for girls and boys. They have Shopkins, and I think the other one was Hot Wheels. And it's just a little cup with a toothbrush and a little holder. And I think something like this is probably gonna be about $3.99 or so at Walmart. So these make great little gifts. Another great 
little either, you know, you can do Easter basket or put these away for stocking stuffers. Are these little boys toothbrushes that come with the little cover that's the car. They're so cute. They came in yellow, green, and blue, I believe. So I picked one of those up. And this is going to be a very popular item. <laughs> I know some little people that really like Star Wars and they had the Stormtroopers. So, picked up a couple of those. Now onto this Mama Jamma find. Pretty and Flawed showed this on her channel. She's amazing if you don't know her. Um, I've watched her for years and years. I just adore her. And it's this massive can of jalapenos. It is six pounds and six ounces. Now, when she hauled this, I don't know if it was a shop with me or she hauled it. Either way, I was on the hunt and I was happy to find it in my store. I love jalapenos. I have a child who loves jalapenos and I'm gonna reuse the can. So I was very excited to pick that up for a dollar. Another food item, this is called a Munchie Mix Sweet and Salty Snack. It's got coconut chips in it, yogurt, raisins, and peanuts. Something like this is great for on the go, so you just don't wanna like run into the grocery store and buy everything when you really should just be shopping for your list. Control your hunger, people. So here's a fun little find that I'm going to gift to some littles in my life. These are little candy sprays. This one is blue blueberry and that's about all there is to say about these uh they say they're a hundred percent source of vitamin c uh yeah this one's green apple and this one is blueberry they're just i'm um, assuming sugar water you can spray on your tongue and when you're an aunt you can give kids stuff like that now a few more household e items and then some toy items this is something that I have in my sink right now. It just needed replaced and we've had it for quite a while. I love these for just little silicone strainers for your kitchen sink, just so you can keep stuff out of that side of your sink from clogging it. They have them in red. I like them in black because then it's just kind of clean looking and I was happy to find them again. I use mine every day. Another find, which these have been out for a while, are their gardening tools. So I've got the itch to get back out and split up. A lot of my succulents have outgrown their pots. So I needed a couple more shovels. They seem to disappear in my house from year to year. I do have kids and we do have a metal detector. So anyways, I got the rake also. And something that I have been wanting but couldn't find at my Dollar Tree just for kitchen use is one of their splatter screens. This one isn't huge. I'm sure you can find a bigger one at Walmart, but whenever I cook something with oil, um, it's nice to have one of these on hand. So I was happy to find that back in my store. We ran out of our lighter. So... I like these, but I really want to find some of those little crock ones that they had in the colors. I'm hoping those come back into Dollar Tree. I will pick some up if they do, because I mainly use them for lighting candles. Every now and then we'll need one for barbecue or something like that. And then some craft items. I needed some more nautical rope for a project coming up soon. And I have no plans for these, but I didn't want to pass them up this little sign thinking of a master plan i shared this in i think my last shop with me at dollar tree i like the back i'm not sure how i'm going to use it yet but i'm sure i'll come up with something and sort of the same thing on this one it's just a nice oval sign when you do diys you just start grabbing things when you don't even have an idea yet in mind because if you blink, they're gonna be out of the store and then you'll come up with an idea and you won't be able to find it. So I picked one up. I do have a little 
good little stash of signs for DIYs. And now some really, I think, fun items. So the first being these cutting boards. And these are by Cooking Concepts. They're not huge, but a nice little wooden cutting board for a dollar. Sign me up. I'm not even sure how I'm going to use it, but I bought a couple and I thought those were great. One more item that is not toy related and then I'll get into some of the great toys they've had. I found this on the food aisle. I will give it a try and let you guys know in my next um, Dollar Tree haul how it works out. I'm going to let my daughter go ahead and use it. It's a rapid brownie baker. So I've been waiting to unbox this until I got in front of the camera for you guys. Let's see what it looks like. So you can do brownies in the microwave, it says in, how long? I thought it said five minutes, four minutes. Okay, so it comes with this plastic contraption, oil, eggs, water, and brownie mix. They say on the back of them, maybe if I turn it, you guys can see it. Okay, interesting. And then this is the Rapid Brownie Baker. Add ingredients to fill line per ingredients box. Pour contents into Rapid Brownie Baker. Mix well. So it's just got the instructions kind of written really lightly on the back. So that's the two pieces. So this is kind of like a measuring contraption. Interesting. I'll let you guys know how this works out. But if you're like me, like my daughter, you get the craving for brownies, you really don't want to wait longer than four minutes, so we'll see how that goes. Okay, some toys that I have picked up. I did get one of these little keychains because it was in the little bunny, and I think this is some kind of cartoon, I think. I'm not really sure, but it's a bunny, and it's Easter. These, I want to say something about. <laughs> I think these are really, really great, and if you can find them in your Dollar Tree for a child in your life, get them. So they're called Motion Spirals. Now it says three plus, I would say probably even a little older, maybe four or five, but at Christmas time, I found one of these at Walmart, and I believe it was $3.99. It could have even been more. I picked it up, I gave it to my son, he loves it. Now he is older than that but um they have them at the dollar tree and it's the same thing different packaging but we have opened one up and it's the same exact thing so save yourself some money they're a lot of fun some other finds in the toy aisle i like to pick things up when they put them out it seems like every spring right before easter they roll out some really great toys which is fun for easter baskets so I put them away for different little gifts. I thought this was really fun and I'm sure that I can find a child in my life that will love it and to go along with it. They also had the Poo Do Squishy Poo Slimy and Sticky Stretch and Twist. That's all I'll say about that. Now, these are sort of my really exciting items that I could not believe I shared this in my shop with me. I put it up right away in hopes that you guys would be able to find them. I did pick up one of the Yokai watch watches. One of you said in the comment section of that shop with me that you bought this at Ross maybe and that it was like eight or nine dollars. So I mean if you're putting together little baskets or gift bags and you can keep your eye open for this, it's an impressive looking little toy for a dollar. I'm not sure how it works. It says you can summon, discover, and collect them. So I'm sure that it has, yep, an app you can download. There you go. And another item that I'm going to keep a look out when I'm at Walmart next to see if it's the same brand because Walmart has been selling these for a while now. These are the little Lego strips. It's by Build Bonanza. 
It says it works with Legos and Mega Blocks and that it is a steel stick and peel tape. So any place that you want to sort of mount your Legos or maybe place your mini figs, you can use these little rolls of Lego style. This is kind of like a silicone. So this store that I went to only had this color combination, which was the orange, purple, black, and blue. But I have seen on Instagram, I think, someone post other color combos. That's my haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I'm picking up at my Dollar Tree. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you back very soon. Mm -hmm.